All right guys, so welcome to the channel and by the title of this video, you already know what's happening. So we've been trying to have our own child and like family planning forever. I mean, you guys have been watching these videos Since and seeing- Since last year. Yeah, we've been failing at it. We're not good at it. We're just like, I guess we're not, it's not meant to be. It's not meant to be for so us. So we decided that instead of creating one of our own, we're gonna go ahead and just take one that somebody already created. Yeah, there's a lot of kids out there that need a home, so we decided we have a home so we can accommodate someone. Right, so the difference between like, I guess, a traditional adoption and like what we are doing is that we're getting someone who's almost eight years old Yeah. with the whole personality. Yeah. And uh, he's going to be dropped off here tomorrow morning, tomorrow. like seven. And uh, we have to wake up much earlier than usual. And then we'll see how it goes because I don't know. We, we met the guy a few times before. I think he's, yeah. he's the right fit for We've, our family. For sure. And he's a son. Yeah. So I, I his... always wanted a son. So I'm just really nervous but also excited. Um, we actually met him four years ago when we first came to Lithuania. And we were thinking of adopting him then. But we didn't know where we wanted to be in life. So we decided to hold off on it. And then since we came back, we saw him again one day in the grocery store. And <laughs> come on, all right, yeah. <laughs> come on, come on, keep it together. We're very excited to be parents for the first time, and um, it starts tomorrow. We have our very first test adoption day with him. <laughs> He's here, mm -hmm. Lava, you know? Lava. Get back and say, get it. He has his encyclopedia. Oh, wow. <laughs> you look like you're still sleeping. Yeah, his mom just dropped him off and told me that. His mom or who? I mean, his, his adoption agency. <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to the channel. We look terrible today, and that is because we're up at 7 30 because we are going to be parents for the next seven hours so simus's little cousin no he's not our adopted son that was just a sick joke <laughs> simus's cousin came to stay with us for uh the day because he is off from school and for the whole day we are going to be basically entertaining him and I don't know, guiding him for the whole day. So we're gonna cook, we're gonna exercise, we're gonna take him to the playground. We're gonna, whatever we're doing today, he's gonna be involved. a good workout so today is gonna be a good example of what it will be like <laughs> if we actually have kids of course he's not a toddler he's eight years old but it's like we just realized that our whole day will be revolving around this little guy and from, like from the moment he got here from 8 a.m. to like whenever his mom picks him up this definitely might be a first, but I've never seen anybody drink tea with both honey and sugar. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's probably way too hot. <laughs> <laughs> Does he want to take out the tea bag? Alright guys, so I have a little guy next to me. We're just chilling here. So we tried watching some cartoons, tried playing some games, tried working out, tried feeding him, and nothing is really working so far, so we're not great parents yet. Yeah. But yeah. so far, so good. I realized that I have literally no idea what to do with a kid. I don't know. I, I don't know what to do. And mm -hmm. everything is okay. I'm basically making a high protein, low carb breakfast and it smells great so we have some sweet potatoes we have zucchini and we have broccoli in here and i'm also going to put some garlic and some scallion and we're going to eat that with three eggs and it's going to be great I, I don't think he's going to eat any so though our little friend didn't eat yet he is tired 
and he wants to sleep. <laughs> you're coming <laughs> twice? <laughs> yeah. I think you're ready. Now oh. you have to read him a story. No, he has his own story. Oh, he's gonna read himself to bed? Mm -hmm. How do you feel putting someone to bed for the first time? Like a dad, I guess. You <laughs> feel like a dad? He's he's not difficult though. He's I guess, I guess he is kind of difficult because it's hard to know what he actually wants. But like at the end of the day, he'll just like agree or disagree with whatever I tell him. So <laughs> like now he finally agreed for me to put him in bed because I know he's tired. I know he's not feeling well and he didn't sleep much. So I told him like, put your phone away, maybe bring a book and just lay down for a bit. So mm. we'll see how he feels. Oh, you're doing a good job. Way better than me. I think our kids will like you more than me. That breakfast is too good, right? <laughs> Your mouth can't even open. So I just went to check in on our little friend and he is completely knocked out. So you guys know what that means. It's our son. I mean, I just went to check on our son. <laughs> I just wanted to check on our son and he's completely knocked out. So Simacy did a good job putting him to bed. Well, let me show you what the guy looks like. So our little guy just woke up and uh, well, not just woke up, probably like 30 minutes now. So we're about to go outside. Um, he has a headache, so we think he might need some fresh air. Alright guys, we decided to take a little walk to the grocery store because the playground was not working. So we're gonna check out uh, a pastry or something just so he could eat something. Okay, Akira. Taste? Mm-hmm. Mm, 33 kilograms for a seven and a half year old. So the reason we're checking his weight is because he's feeling a little sick and we're checking if it's okay to give him like this a pill. Tylenol. Yeah, yeah, a Tylenol. So uh, we checked his weight, his age and everything seems to be okay that we can give him half of those. Yeah. So there should be no problem with that and then hopefully he feels a little bit better. Moving forward. You're a chemist by profession. Uh oh, where's the other half? On the floor. Okay. Technically, I'm a chemist, right? <laughs> well, I'm not even joking. I actually am. <laughs> Before this, I was working in a chemistry lab, so I yeah. approved this pill for this guy. I really hope it helps. Che? Nuri? Uh uh. It's still there. Mm -hmm. Uh, I can't believe it. It's he can't do it. He can't do it. No? Too big. Oh? Still there? I think, I think it worked. That was stressful to watch, right? I never <laughs> thought I'd be stressed out watching someone swallow a pill. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, God. I'm not cut out for this life. <laughs> this is what he's eating. So there's he's not uh, necessarily approved so by me. He said what? If I forgot to turn this thing off. Wait, who's the dad here? <laughs> Not me. <laughs> yeah. Whatever ideas we had of raising a healthy child, they just went right out the window because we're here we are stuffing him with pizza and hot dogs. And I'm actually happy that he's eating at all rather than just making sure. I wouldn't give him candy for breakfast. That's what he wanted. Not under my watch. As you cut his pizza in half? <laughs> yeah, mother of the year over here. Anyway, so he's not feeling okay, so he deserves a little break. But um, if it was up to me, he'd be eating broccoli. I think he'd starve instead of eat broccoli, because that's how that's the kind of child this one is. But mm -hmm. anyway, it's been. Let me see what time it is. I guess it's officially 6 p.m., which means that my cousin, aka our adopted parent, is gonna come back and claim her child. So we actually nursed him right back to health. That pill that he took turn him into a different person. He looks so much better, he feels better, he's over there playing Mario Kart. He went and like washed his face and he just looks fresh. And I think we're in good shape to give him back now, right? Yeah, I think also because he ate, he feels better too. 
Yes, and then we finally made sure that he ate. So successful day, a bit stressful. Yeah. But I think we did all right for our first time being parents of a semi teenager, I guess. <laughs> preteen. <laughs> a preteen, yeah. I swear when he carried that Nintendo, it's like he carried his briefcase after work and he's just done. So he went back to read his book. Uh, so now the next thing is he picked back up his encyclopedia. <laughs> this all about balance. Yep. So we're balanced. We actually did a lot today. Today we did reading. We did some spelling because he's actually working on that. Um, we did, of course, some video games. We did try to get him to exercise, but he really wasn't feeling it. And I'm giving him a pass today because he's not feeling great. Uh, we got him to sleep a bit. We took him outside. We tried to go to the playground and the playground was really not it. But he helped us with taking out trash and picking up some groceries. And then we came back, did some drawing, did some hanging out, some talking. He told me some stories and here we are. He's right back to where he started with his encyclopedia in his hand. So, <laughs> so this is Jonas's this is mom. This the mom of the child that we had all day. <laughs> oh, and look, there's another one. Look. <laughs> this is Rusna, and she's not very nice. <laughs> she's nice. <laughs> Look at my hair. <laughs> I started this vlog with good looking hair. Look at my hair now. Look at mine too. So why do I look like James oh, Brown? <laughs> but my, oh mine is on, mine's on flick though. Yeah, your hair looks better than mine. Maybe you should braid my hair next. Uh, yeah, about that. Yeah, but so what's your what's your recap? Actually, let me go fix my hair. I can't. <laughs> All right, so... What's the consensus? So we had two kids in here today for even for five minutes, but the consensus is... I think we can handle it, but it's... Two? Two at once, maybe not right away, but... Like little by little? Little by little. <laughs> like have Let's one focus on one first. Have one and then have another one later, maybe? No, no, no. I'm just doing one. I, I don't think I'm capable of doing two. Your mother was capable of two. That's my mom. Mm -hmm. I'm a different person. Mm -hmm. Anyways, I think the day went very well, considering that he wasn't feeling that well. Yeah. And uh, it is his first time being alone with us, because usually we meet up with his parents and he's there. Mm -hmm. But I think that he was very comfortable with you. Yeah. And I actually really, really do believe and I see that Simis will be an amazing dad. Aww. Like, amazing. May even forget about me in the process, but <laughs> like he threw me to the dogs today, but it's okay. <laughs> I didn't throw you to the dog. I, I, I was like, Simis, I'm so scared. There's a dog. He's like, just walk. And then like, he's there with the kid. Oh, you okay? You okay? I asked him, I'm like, are you scared? He's like, no. And then I was there having a panic attack behind you. Okay. But yeah, so, Simis will care more about our kid than me. To be clear, there are no stray dogs in Atlanta, but there was one dog outside and we see him. I think it's the people's dog and they let him like venture outside of the initial yard yeah. for some reason. So anyway. I think with kids that age, you have to keep them busy. Yeah. Yeah, you have to figure out what to give to them to do. And it doesn't necessarily mean like a tablet or yeah. You know, TikTok or something he, like he that. He gets bored pretty fast. But yeah, 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 yeah. So I have a lot of work to do, <laughs> a lot of internal work too. You know, a lot of research. <laughs> Language corrections. Language corrections. I gotta like. Oof. I spend too much time with just Simmons. I have to like calm it down. But yeah. at least I'm recognizing the things that I need to do in order to become a better person. Mm -hmm. Right. It's a start. All right. Anyways, guys, let us know what you think of this video down below. And thanks so much for hanging out with us. And um, we'll see you next time. And we'll enjoy this child-free night for sure. Absolutely.